The IOTA IAS series microinverters are versatile units that deliver emergency power to a range of lighting fixtures and can be used in conjunction with your local wall switches or other on-off control devices. But what if you wanted to use dimming controls or other energy saving devices with IAS microinverters? IOTA offers a simple solution that can enable the use of 0 to 10 volt dimming controls with microinverters in the form of the ETS emergency control device. The IOTA ETS is an intelligent device that can bypass dimmer settings for your emergency fixture in emergency situations. Combining an ETS with an IAS series microinverter will allow you to save energy going to your emergency lights with dimming controls and be confident that your emergency lights will deliver required illumination during an emergency situation. Incorporating the IOTA ETS and microinverter in your circuit is an easy wiring process. First, you will wire the IAS microinverter as normal according to the instructions in your installation manual. For simplicity, in this video we've only included the violet yellow and gray output wires that connect to the normal hot and normal neutral wires of your AC fixture. The full steps to wiring your IAS microinverter can be found in your installation manual or online at iotaengineering.com slash iasinverter. Next, we will incorporate the IOTA ETS and your dimming control into the circuit. After wiring power to the dimming control based on its manufacturer's specifications, the ETS will interface with its output leads. The violet lead from the dimming control will connect to the blue lead from the ETS. Then, the gray lead from the dimming control will connect to the gray dimming lead on your AC fixture. Afterwards, the black-orange wire from your ETS will connect to the violet dimming lead on your AC fixture to close the dimming loop. And the last two wires we will connect will be the black power wire and the white neutral wire coming from your ETS, and these wires will be connected to your normal power line ahead of the dimming control. And the remaining ETS wires will all be capped, as they are not needed in this application. At this point, your IOTA ETS and IAS microinverter will be successfully installed in your system. During a normal power situation, the IOTA ETS allows the dimming signal from your dimming control to pass through to your AC fixture. However, should a power loss occur, the ETS will sense the drop in power along the normal line and open the 0 to 10 volt dimming loop. This means that when your IAS microinverter supplies emergency power to your AC fixture, the lights will come on at full brightness. The IOTA ETS is an excellent way to bring dimming functionality to an IOTA IAS microinverter. And although this video was specific to microinverters, this versatile unit can also bring dimming control to IAS mini inverters and IOTA emergency drivers as well. Regardless of which application you choose, the IOTA ETS can help you save energy while maintaining code required emergency illumination on your emergency lights. For any additional questions about the IOTA ETS, or to determine whether it would be right for your fixture, please call IOTA Customer Support or visit us online at iotaengineering.com. Thank you for watching this video and have a nice day.